Frederick Sheldon Brandt was born in New Jersey, USA. His parents, Irving and Esther Brandt, owned a candy store. As a child, he was interested in medicine, later graduating from Rutgers University and receiving a medical degree from the Hahnemann College of Medicine, a residency in nephrology and oncology at New York University and a residency in dermatology at the University of Miami. After working for some time at the Memorial Sloan Kettering Cancer Center, Frederick opens his own Dr. S. office in Miami. He eliminated skin defects with the help of plastics and injections. He was called a jeweler in his field in professional circles. His contribution to cosmetology is invaluable, he constantly improved procedures, tried everything new on himself, wanting to achieve maximum naturalness. Frederick devoted himself to the study of new technologies, experimented with natural ingredients, made green tea a popular skincare product, developed miraculous acne creams, an excellent skin cleansing milk based on natural ingredients. Brantes rejuvenation procedures became popular, and Frederick was in great demand, he was approached by Donna Karen and Calvin Klein, Naomi Campbell, and Linda Evangelista, Stephanie Seymour and Ellen Barkin and many others. He has developed lines, laser in a bottle, laser lightning range, laser appeal kit, creams and peels that make the skin young and radiant. Working for wear and tear, he managed to conduct an author s radio program and even planned to release his own television show. In rare hours of rest, he did yoga and even wrote rap. Despite the worldwide fame, the personal life of a plastic surgeon did not work out, in Miami, his outlet was three mutts picked up on the street. Fearing old age, he injected himself with Botox and fillers, followed a diet, but his face lost its naturalness, he became a model of anti-advertising for the services he offered. In the 2010s, Botox prices are falling, now it is produced in India and China, the service is no longer elitist. Frederick tried to endure black stripes quite steadfastly, but the comedy television series Unbending Kimmy Schmidt became a crushing blow for him. Where the appearance of the protagonist, Drive Grand, was copied from Brandt. After the series ed, Brandt cancelled all appointments and began seeing a psychiatrist. On April 5, 2015, unable to bear the emotional burden, Frederick Brandt hanged himself in the garage of his Miami mansion. He has authored two books on skin aging and staying youthful, 10 Minutes 10 Years, Your Ultimate Guide to Beautiful and Young Looks and Ageless, The Ultimate Guide to Botox, Collagen, Lasers, Peeling, and More Solutions for Flawless Skin. His work in the field of research on rejuvenation procedures laid the foundation for a huge multi-million dollar beauty industry. Now the methods and preparations have become safer, and the technologies are sparing, we owe the opportunity to prolong our youth and beauty, including drive. Brand and his lineless eye cream is still Madonna's favorite care product.